guys. Welcome to today's MCAT question of the day. As always, we'll be working our way through one of the many MCAT practice problems found at MCATSelfPrep.com, the home of the free MCAT prep course. I'm Andrew George, a 99th percentile MCAT tutor, and I'll be walking you through today's practice problem as if you're one of my private tutoring students. Be sure to hit pause and try this problem for yourself before watching my explanation. Take a look at these two totemers. What do you notice that's different about them? What you should notice is that they have the same atoms, they're just connected differently. For instance, in the enol form, this hydrogen is located here, but in the keto form, it's located over here. We have the same atoms, they're just connected differently. With that background in mind, let's take a look at this chart comparing all the different types of isomers. And we covered this chart in a previous MCAT question of the day, so if you're unfamiliar with how to determine which type of isomer is which, make sure to check out that video. In this case, well, all we have to do is answer the first couple questions. Do the compounds have the same molecular formula? Yes. Do the compounds have the same connectivity? No. Therefore, we know we're dealing with a constitutional isomers in this case. Therefore, the correct answer to this question is answer choice C. If you enjoyed this question of the day, be sure to give it a like. And for more questions of the day, be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel and enroll in our free MCAT prep course found at MCATSelfPrep.com. And if you are really looking to maximize your MCAT score, feel free to visit my tutoring profile page and request a free 10-minute phone consultation. I would love to chat with you about your situation and how you can maximize your MCAT score. I look forward to hearing from you soon. We will see you next time.